What's up, pipe smokers out there in YouTube land? How's it going? All right, I'm back with another quick pipe tobacco review. Uh, just recently, I reviewed uh, one of the new Missouri Meerschaum pipe tobaccos, which was Country Gentleman, and uh, that one was pretty good. Now I'm reviewing Missouri Meerschaum Great Dane. Hope you can see that okay. Great Dane. That's what it looks like in the pouch. Now I gotta tell you, this one is pretty good stuff. Mm, it has kind of a vanilla cookie um, kind of aroma to it. Uh, that's what it looks like in there. It says a deep sweet Cavendish blend with notes of dark cherry and fragrant vanilla. I don't detect a lot of cherry uh, flavor in this one. Because as most of you know, I'm not into cherry blends. I don't care much for cherry blends. Um, but this one is really good. Um, it's a nice uh, aromatic. Um, it's pretty smooth. I didn't really detect any bite to it. Um, they say it's a Danish inspired aromatic. Uh, good portion of gently steamed black Cavendish, select Virginia's and some white burley. Topped with a smooth and rich combination of deep dark cherry without the sharpness of the typical maraschino flavor and warm notes of vanilla and caramel for an easy smoking blend with lightly sweet flavor. Yeah, I think that's what I detect. I said vanilla, kind of vanilla caramel um, kind of <laughs> aroma to it. Um, but this is good stuff. Uh, I'm surprised uh, by these Missouri Meerschaum pipe tobacco blends. Country Gentleman's a good one. Um, check out my review on that one. This Great Dane's good if you're into aromatics like I am. I think you'll like this one. Um, and if you don't like cherry blends like me, um, you'll still like this one. I mean, it says cherry. Like I said, I don't detect a lot of cherry. Um, but it's pretty good, so. Thumbs up. Missouri Marisham, Great Dane. Check it out. And I will catch you later. Thanks for watching. Bye.